After you open the official website of CalGen Solutions and log into your account, you will see your name displayed on the upper right corner. When you move your cursor towards it, a drop-down menu is shown. Then, from the options given, select My Dashboard, which will direct you towards your profile page. Go to the left corner of the profile page and press the My Apps button. You will find the applications that have been subscribed. In this case, search for the Bowl Torque Calculator and click it. As soon as you enter inside the application, you will see the interface of the app. You can find the input section, which requires four input values from the users. Some default values are already assigned to the input parameters. You will have to change those values as per your requirements. Some of the frequently used specifications, along with its value, are presented for the convenience of the user. The output section is located at the bottom of the interface. Let us take one example for understanding the operation of the application. These are the input parameters for doing the calculation. First of all, we will enter the value of thread major diameter. The diameter should be in inch and decimal values are also allowed. We will enter 1.25 inch in this space. You can also scroll the mouse or use the drop down menu to get the value of standard size. Now, for the value of coefficient of friction, you can make an input based on the reference given below or enter other values as per your requirement. Let's take 0.13 in this case. For the bolt yield strength, enter the yield strength value in PSI. Yield strength value of commonly used materials are provided below for convenience. Also, you can enter any other value as per your requirement. Since our requirement matches with that of the second case, we take 95,000 PSI as our input. Now, for the last parameter, which is percent yield, two conditions are given below. If your condition matches with the information provided, then you can choose input value accordingly. Otherwise, you can also make an input based on your preference. Our condition being a PI17D, we choose 70% as our input value. Once you have entered all the input parameters, press Calculate to get the torque and bolt tension. The output is expressed in both US customary and SI units. There is another button alongside the Calculate, which is the Reset button. When you press this Reset button, all the input parameters will have the default values in them. Thanks for watching. Calgen Solutions.